Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nur Harisha Fairin binti Muhammad Sufyan from Sekolah Kebahasaan Seri Broli Batu Pahat Johor. Today, I'll tell you the story of my life in the time of COVID-19. It is the biggest issue that the world has been trying to solve until today. I believe that you and I are still struggling to survive and in this pandemic era with the new normal routines. Every day, we are told to obey the standard operating procedure or SOP to avoid the risk of being infected by the virus. Unfortunately, the virus was spread globally, including in my beloved country, Malaysia, where all of us has to undergo such a, such a period called quarantine or lockdown situation like movement, control or the MCO. Suddenly, it looked like a dead world at first. So gloomy, no hope and nothing to do. All outdoor activities including sports, gatherings and school stop. It was a big, terrible paranoid ever in my mind. Luckily, even though the schools were closed due to the pandemic, to pandemic. I could still continue my studies at home. All the learning processes were delivered in online form, including my school. I still remembered when my English teacher, Teacher Fatikin, always advised us to stay safe at home and asked her if there any problem we faced during online class. I was excited to join her visual classroom because it was a new experience experience for me. I am thankful until today because my teacher always creates fun activities for us to try and I will also get online certificate each time I join her class. I would like to thank as well as to my other teachers who had been struggling to deliver knowledge as online class was a challenging one. During movement control order, I didn't go anywhere. I just focused doing my online class, sleeping, helping my mom, and keep doing the same daily routines at home. So boring, right? Sometimes I called my friends. I also must follow the rules of health SOP such as wearing face mask or face shield, using hand sanitizer, and washing my hands more often. Today, Malaysia has reached one step ahead when the vaccine program that had been announced for free. Hopefully, the person infected by the COVID-19 virus will be cured easily via this vaccination and not being infected again in the future. With this fabulous effort done by our country, it is hoped that all of us could get back to our normal daily routines like before. I miss all my shopping days, doing sport with my friends, and having family celebration as well as traveling. Thank you, Malaysia, for the marvelous effort. Finally, we won the battle of fighting COVID-19 and the pandemic end. Thank you and wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.